Stop here, can't stop here. Come on. Step back, back up. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Need you to back up, please. Back up, back up please. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Step back, please. No, I need to back up. I know you did. We're going straight through here, please. Come right here. Back up, everybody back up. Back up, back up. We need to get over here. Yeah. Oh my God, I want a picture so bad. Back up. Back up. Back up. Hey, John, if you can hear me, um, as, as soon as, if we, if they clear out, I want to try and grab some people that out here, okay. if, you know, once we get. Oh, 
Oh my God, don't push, don't push, don't push. Don't need to push. No need to push. She has a baby. Don't push. Don't push. She has a baby. Please don't push. Don't push. Don't push. She has a baby. Don't push, please. She has a baby. But I know who she is, and that was amazing. It's gonna be an amazing experience. Tell me your story. Um, we're off the east, um, the east side, Mason Sitwell. The water came in Sunday night. We waited for rescue, but unfortunately, it was other places that were way underwater than we were. Monday, my husband and my brother in law actually floated my kids out in an ice box, and from there, we've been here. Tell me who this is. This is Crystal. Hey, hey, my wife. She's not. It's amazing because it's not this isn't her city, so she's really not obligated to, you know. But it's it's great. It's really great. Yeah. What's your name? Shay. How do you spell it? S H A Y. And your last name? Smith. Smith. Yes. She got a picture. Yes. Thank you. Um, what's your name? Shay. Shay. I just saw a beautiful dog. Shay. Shay. She got Shay. She got. I was Come on. Oh, is she going to see you? Wait, where's she going? Oh. Did you get a good picture? Well, I got this one of her in the mail. So what's it mean to have her come here and just to be able to see her? It means everything for her to take out the time and come visit us, you know, the you know, Hurricane Harvey victims. It shows her humanity that she understands and she's just not only a famous celebrity, but she's also a human being at the end of the day. And it makes me love her more and admire her more. Yeah. I know it's kind of overwhelming. So many people wanting to just, you know, get them close to her. Yes, yes, ma'am. Uh, I feel like I could use a cold bottle of water right now. It's just like a dream come true to see Janet close up in person like that and just to realize that she's just kind, loving, concerned, and you can tell that she has great, you know, character, just like a late brother, Michael. Yeah. And, uh, tell me your story. Uh, well, my name is Jackie. I got here last week, Wednesday, and um, we're one of the flood victims living on Tidwell, West Tidwell. So we just appreciate all the help and assistance that FEMA and Backpost have been giving us. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Did you get a good snapshot of her with the baby by chance? Uh, yes. She, okay, okay. Yeah. That was precious. Did you get a good one? Would you mind texting that to me? Sure. Okay. Here, let me, I'm going to just scoot around here. Um, and are you here? Okay. Okay, great. Oh, wow. She's trying to get... Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? What's your name? Casina. How do you spell that? K E S E N A. And um, are you here at the shelter? Um, yeah. Okay, what was it like to meet Miss Jackson? Um, I was kind of nervous, and I didn't know he had a sister. I thought he only had four brothers. So you're an aspiring actress, too? Um, or? well, I'm getting there. How has this experience been? How are you feeling? How's your family? Um, a little nervous, but a little excited. And what happened to your home? What's your situation? Well, it didn't really get flooded. Just it got flooded a little in our exercise oh. room. Okay. Yes, we have questions. So, um, tell me just how you ended up here at the shelter and what's next for your life. Okay. Well, I'm Marilyn State, and this is Casina, and um, we um, end up evacuating. Uh, we had mandatory evacuation because of the Barker Reservoir release, and so we, were, we came here and found out that um, there are so many services here that we were amazed, and so today we came back. I, I lost my glasses, so I came to pick up my glasses, and then now um, I also brought some things to donate as well because of the, the tremendous help they give, and, 
and, and all the things they do here was amazing, so we appreciate everything. So I, I brought her back. She wanted to play in the playground. We had no idea Janet would be here. And I was like, she's always running into her, you know, famous actors and celebrities when we go places, and she's one too. So she's always fortunate to meet people like her. So I was wanting to make sure Janet at least took her hand. So she did reach out and shake her hand. So that was amazing. So yeah, we, we evacuated to Austin the first when we, you know, the first hit. And so we had to, um, she had an audition in Austin at the time. And so it was going to be Monday, and if we didn't leave the day before, she would have never made it. So we, we had to take off to Austin. So we got stuck there because we couldn't get back in. And so, so on the way there, on the way to Austin, we found that um, there was so much water on the road, on, this, on, the, on the emergency lanes. And we were, I was just in shock and, and amazed that I was even out with my child at that, by myself on the road to Austin in such danger. So, but we did leave to avoid uh, the flood, and so we couldn't get back in. So we were, we were kind of stranded for five days in Austin. And uh, so um, we came back um, two days after and it took us two and a half hours to get here, but two and a half hours once we got in Houston to get home because of 99, everything flooded. And so only the second day after getting here, we find out we have the, the, res the reservoirs were released, so now we were forced to get out. So we left and came up here just to make sure we don't get flooded again. And I did receive some water in one of the rooms, but I'm so grateful and thank God that the what little we had, so many people lost much more, you know, lives and, and homes. So I'm just fortunate. I don't care if we did lose, I mean, flood in one area, more importantly, people suffered greatly more than we did. So we came here and found out that so far our area wasn't flooded, so we went back home, and we didn't get to stay here. We just left and went back home, and we've been here ever since, so then my glasses were ready, so we, she wanted to come here, and I wanted to bring some more things, because and most people are, are, have left, so it looks like they found places to stay and, and hotels, so I'm happy to hear that people are, you know, on the road to recovery to at least get a measure of their... Uh, safety and, and a place to stay and, and food and stuff. It's just amazing how everybody's reaching out to help one another. So I wish I could do more. Thank you. What's yes. your name again? Marilyn Staten. How do you spell that? S T A T E N. Okay. And yes. your uh, your name is Casina. C A K E S E N A. Okay. Thank you for spelling that. And do you mind sending me? Actually, can I? 